Hey guys, I'm Nick and I'm back and today I'm going to be showing you men's pants that everybody needs in their wardrobe no matter what their style or fashion taste is. Having the right pants will allow you to put any outfit together at any time and you'll be ready for just about anything. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you don't know me, I'm Nick and I'm reviewing some of the best clothing brands on the market with the goal to design my own based on fit, feel, quality, and much more. As always, please comment and like the video and please be sure to subscribe as it really helps the channel grow. Also, you'll be entered into all of our giveaways coming in the future. Okay, so pants can really make an outfit. You don't wanna spend a lot of time on an outfit, putting something together, building it, and then having the pants be lazy at the last second and that whole outfit being ruined. Let's face it too, shopping for pants can be a pain, a real pain, with countless trips to the fitting rooms and trying on different pair after pair. But hopefully I can solve some of those problems for you today. I've searched the internet, read reviews, and worn these different pants for years, and I'm gonna show you them right now. For me, the most important thing about pants is the way they fit. For me, you don't have to spend a bunch of money, you just have to make sure they fit you right. I know it can be confusing shopping online and different size charts and seeing the different features of each pant. So let's dive in right now. Okay, so the first thing everybody needs in their wardrobe is a great pair of joggers. Joggers are great for a leisure outfit or even hanging out, going out with friends, and a workout. Some of my favorite joggers are the ABC Jogger by Lululemon and the Public Rec All Day Every Day Jogger. Another great option is the Built Basics Jogger. It's a little bit cheaper than the other two options because they're always running promotions on the site. These three joggers you can wear for sport or leisure if you want. The best fitting for me of all three was the Public Rec jogger because they allow you to choose your specific inseam. I did a review on the Public Rec all day everyday jogger below and you can check it out if you want. Be sure to look at the size charts on the website when you're picking your joggers. The last thing you want is baggy joggers that don't fit right or are too long. You really want a nice athletic tailored fit with a tight feel around the cuff of the ankle. The fit of the joggers is the key to making them look good. All three of these joggers were good fitting to me and they weren't too tight on the legs. So if you have bigger thighs, don't worry about that as well. All right, so now we're gonna move on to sweats. Sweats are another option if you don't like the jogger look but still want that casual feel. Some of the best sweats come from Public Rec again. They have an all day, everyday pant. And then again, Built has another sweat pant called the Built Pant. If you're looking for something sneaky affordable that's kind of low key and not too expensive, look at Old Navy too. I know it may sound weird, but I've gotten some of my best sweats from them that I wear all the time and they look good and they feel good too. Again, you want your sweats to be the right length, just above the ankle and an athletic tailored fit. If they're too long or not a tailored fit, they're gonna look sloppy and ruin the whole outfit. All right, now we're gonna move on to the next one, the five pocket pant or the chino. These pants are super versatile and you can wear them with any type of outfit. You can dress them up and dress them down and they're just an all around great pant to have. My favorite are the five pockets from Stitch Golf because you can wear them with a polo shirt, a button up, or even a really nice dinner outfit. Another great option is from Polo. The specific ones I have from Stitch and Polo are tapered, so I recommend getting those. These are the same as any other pant. You should have a nice tailored fit and the right length. If you have to get them tailored, get them tailored. All right, so the fourth type of pant you should have in your wardrobe is the style pant. These could be cargos, corduroys, or just a printed pant that you like. A great cargo is from Levi's and it's called the Men's 502 Cargo Pant. It fits well and it's very durable. Another great pant is the Corduroy from J. Crew. It's called the Men's 770 Corduroy Pant. This is a solid pant that lasts a long time even though it's a little bit cheaper price point. I've worn J. Crew pants for years and they've always fit good and held up over time. The only thing I really needed to tailor on them was maybe the length at the bottom, but the fit on the leg was great overall. For me, I don't wear a style pant often, but when you do, it's nice to have good quality options in your closet. Number five is jeans. Jeans have always been a staple for men's pants. Jeans should be durable enough to last you years and years to come. There's even a stretch denim out now that's new that has a four-way stretch to it. Again, like any other type of pant we've talked about today, they should be a nice tailored fit and not too long or short. Some of the best jeans I've tried are the Levi's 511 tailored fit jeans for men. And Wrangler makes one called the Larston. Most of these options will have a slim fit jean or pant too, so check the size chart on every website you're shopping from. A higher price point jean would be from AG. These are my favorite and they're a little bit higher in price, but they're definitely worth it. My favorite pair from them is a slim straight jean from AG. Since it is a higher price point, you may want to go try them on before ordering and they usually have a decent selection at Nordstrom. When buying pants, try to have one or two of each pair in each different category and you'll be able to put together any outfit. Alright guys, well that sums up this video and I hope you enjoyed it. 
I hope it took some of the pain out of shopping for men's pants. If you've ever tried any of the pants mentioned in this video, please leave me a comment below telling me things you liked and disliked. Stay tuned for more videos and I really appreciate the support and everybody watching. Be sure to subscribe as it really helps the channel grow. Thanks guys and live high low.